Well, next month, you're going to be tempted to do something you've been told not to do forever. Look at the sun. Vision plays an important role in your life, and it's important to protect the eyes. Eye doctors have some critical eye safety recommendations when seeing the eclipse. A total solar eclipse is rare, but the moon will cast a shadow on Earth next month. Eye doctors are warning of the damage which could happen if you look directly at it. Well, it can happen within seconds. Dr. Elizabeth Muckley of the Ohio Optometric Association treated two patients with damage after the partial solar eclipse in 2017. Many schools will take April 8th off since it would be difficult to follow every child that day. They have a clear crystal lens, uh, lens inside their eye and they might be tempted to look and, and they would have a higher concentration of those rays getting to the back of their retina compared to someone with cataracts that have already developed. The sun is dangerous to look at for people of every age. You could get a little blind spot and even lose best corrected vision. In some cases, damage is permanent. In others, symptoms could take a year to go away. Optometrists recommend using approved solar viewers. They say sunglasses are not enough, even to pair. And we also want to make sure that we're not holding our phone cameras up and taking pictures and looking uh, at the eclipse through a phone without the protection as well. Eye doctors recommend wearing the correct solar shields with a safety stamp. Be careful if you think about using those eclipse glasses from 2017, since any cracks and scratches on the lens put your eyes at risk. We want everybody in Ohio to enjoy this event uh, and and. Experience this phenomenon since we won't have another one for many, many years to come. But we want to make sure that they are preparing and doing it safely, and especially with children. The Ohio Optometric Association says if you experience any changes in vision, see an optometrist for an exam. Hi, everyone. I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.